Hey guys, welcome back. Dominic Silver Screening Reviews, a little more Detroit Become Human. Last time we left off, we uh, evaded the cops, we freed uh, Luther from their possession, and some other guy. Yeah, I don't know who he was. Um, he looked familiar, but I, I can't place the name to save my life. And we're all right here outside the bus. Let's look at the flowchart and see what we've done. Or, oh god, we're 8%, oh my god, we're 8% complete. Loser, say, oh, oh, we could not, and Jerry, who the fuck is Jerry? Hmm. So we're right here. Oh, we could have continued if we had chosen. This would have been... I don't know what this would have been. But he's still alive, so that's all that matters, I suppose, to be honest. A checkpoint. Correct. We have passports. It should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time. We could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be safer. Choose a route. Where's the other route? I'm confused. Three minutes or... Well, we've always chosen the risky route before, so... I think that other route's 11 minutes. We couldn't even get here in time. Because the bus leaves in 9, right? Right? Shit, yeah, we couldn't even go that way. Shh. Okay, well, that's fine. There's just not enough time left. I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Yeah, they just probably should. All right, Luther. Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. You do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Where are you going? We're going to take a bus across the border. Put my daughter someplace safe until things calm down. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's cold. She's sick. A bad flu. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are TVs around and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Hey, wait a minute. What's up? Knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. No. You dropped it. Hey, thank you. You're welcome. Hey, nice. We're coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. That was a hard, hard transition. It's the 
11 o'clock at night. We're the leader of Jericho. We'll march to the camp. I just want to see what else we have going on here. He hasn't done anything here. He's inside the elevator still. <laughs> So Carl leaving Detroit, which we saw. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? Oh, we're not done yet. Okay. I was like, excuse me? Car captured, which probably isn't a thing. And Marcus Revolution is probably not a thing. Because we have Marcus Demonstration at the moment. So clearly, again, there's not much to go here. But this is a lot like Heavy Rain in the sense that, well, a lot of your choices matter. And there was a lot of choices in this game that clearly had an outcome because we saw them. Like, we saw saving this guy or talking to this guy or... Like, saving... I, it didn't matter, I guess, at the end, but saving the the police officer in the very first mission, he showed up in, like, two hours ago, you know? Like, he was there. And it didn't matter any, per se, but there's been a few other things, where, and, and that's the only one that comes to mind at the moment, but there's been a few other points in the game where doing something early, especially in the investigation parts, which remind me, again, of the Jaden sequences... In, uh, in Heavy Rain, where you have to have enough information to be able to move forward. Otherwise, you kind of track off into a not a bad ending, but a worse ending, you know? Where you, you can't solve everything by yourself. Like, either you have to solve it as somebody else, or... But these guys don't seem to interlink a lot. Like, they, they've met up on Jericho, but... And... and... I guess Kara and Luther are just fucking taking off, you know, where Marcus and uh, Marcus is doing his march, Connor's trying to free more people, more androids from Cyberlife. Um there's there's a lot going on in this game. And again, I don't mean that like metaphorically. <laughs> it's pretty straightforward and, and it, it is preaching of life is life, you know, don't treat don't treat androids like animals type thing. Three, two, one, cheers. Uh, let's go. I was kind of hoping I could do this up here. <laughs> oh, he doesn't do well if you move him. You just kind of need to keep him straight. So they're gonna shoot us in mass again, or? Did it last time. Didn't see human stuff. So if we walk forward about six feet, it'll probably trigger, right? Here we are. The moment of truth. Okay, that scares me every time support is or public uh, opinion is supportive every time it does that I think the game crashes oh, We got we got journalists here nice We don't want confrontation We are protesting peacefully We're gonna keep pushing it. So 
okay. It's okay. There's no turning back now. Literally. We ask that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. We will not resort Public to opinion violence. Public skyrocketing. But we are not leaving until our people are free. Oh, they move with me. Fire! Jesus. Up. Are you going to open fire on unarmed protesters? Oh, oh, because the news is here, huh? The journalists are taking photos. Hold your fire. Of course. You just murdered a whole bunch of other people. Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out as long as we can. Because we need, yep, I'm like, we need Connor to not murder people. <laughs> Stay sharp. Shit. We're in a bad spot for him. Shit. Okay. Okay. Uh. Oh, we had to hit all three of them. Okay. Glad we were. We did that fast enough to make that matter. off a gun, which is good. They all look the same. How do I convert you people? So am I just like fucking Let me hold all all the buttons, right? Step back, Connor! And I'll spare him. Sorry, Connor. What? This bastard just spit an image. Oh okay, okay. Okay, what did we say earlier? They said Connor Android. We've arrived, Dallas. We made it. Okay, so there are multiple. God damn it! Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. We need the tickets. tickets. They won't let us on. Find a way to leave. How do we get tickets? Well, we're stuck here now. What are we going to do? Well, it, it means, it means we're gonna kind of have to be assholes, aren't we? I think Very Oliver dead. likes you. Oh. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. Thank you. So is yours. Okay. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. <gasps> yes. The odds. Security check. Please I'm sorry. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I was sure. Shit, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You kind of lost them. 
Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The, the envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? Nope. It has our bus tickets in it, and... Oh, never mind. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? We can't stay here. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. I'm so sorry, honey. I no don't knows. know what happened. They were right here in my bag. I... Catch the bus. Got your ticket? Yes, here they are. Okay, go ahead. Thank you very much. God, I feel like a piece of shit. Here's the thing, though. They're gonna murder all three of us, you know? Like... Get on the bus. Just get on the bus. What's going to happen to that family and their baby? I don't know. Will they die because of us? I don't know. We had to make a choice about us. It was them or us. Were they androids? I mean, did they seem like humans. I mean, they had a baby, you know? I don't understand why they were trying to flee to Canada other than trying to get their baby out of Detroit, which, you know, fair enough. I'm assuming they can get tickets tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Back to Marcus. What are we doing? It's like a barricade? We have journalists looking at us. Reinforced barricade, huh? We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Hey, help me! This is still mostly illegal. Like, you're, you're allowed to protest and you have your right to assemble, but you can't block off, like, public streets, you know? Right, that should do it. Like, and they're stealing signs and shit in people's cars and... It's not an easy decision to make. Josh, I'm not your friend, man. But I'm sure we're doing the right thing. I was actually super hoping that Josh, like, his head would be blown the fuck up. What going on here? Oh, yes. I don't know why I have a weird fascination with, like, starting these barrel fires. Very indigo prophecy. Okay, so it looks like it's best to go this way. Does the message to the journalist? We are here for peace! Okay. Does that do anything? No. What's over here? We got something- okay. Are you all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. It 
could have been me. I'm scared. It could have. I don't want to shut down. But it wasn't. We're here because we never want to feel that fear again. Because we're more than what they say. That's what our people died for, right? That's why we're here. Okay, that's one. What the fuck is this? Oh, it's a fucking book. <laughs> uh, they defy us. It's like what's happening right now. Uh, taken to the street and apocalyptic scenes. Uh, they're and they're basically talking about us. That's the first. Okay, what else is here? What do we got? A few people here? Get in this crowd? Is this a book? Is it these people who are here? Okay. Many of our people have fallen. They have. The humans have no pity for those who are different. Well, glad I could help. Thanks, I guess. Marcus, we found what you asked for. Now, uh, more of those laser guns? journalists over there. We have to make sure they know what's going on. It's not going to be the same sign. I think it's just going to be the words alive, right? Okay, support your people. Oh, so this is this. Well, let's light this, just so it's out of our way, you know? It seemed like there were things over here. The police, I'm assuming, right? Is this necessary? Well, I don't know, maybe. They won't stop there. What are we going to do if they attack? Resist. That's the only thing we can do. I think Connor has any chance of making it? They we can do only not know. now. But I'm not gonna let that other Connor fucking live. I'm gonna tell you that much for free. That's north. Hello. This won't hold him for long, but. Okay, I'd like to go talk to the other people. They're getting into position. If they attack, no one will survive. How many more of us have to die? Is there any cause worth giving your life for? You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No matter what happens now, we're making history. We're not doing that. Put that away, please. No! Okay, I thought, I, for whatever reason, he looked at it so long that I thought he was going to freak out and do it. I'm like, we're not doing that. Wait, what? There's more over 
over here? Okay. We talk to our people. What's going on over here? I don't know, we saw this. We saw this screwy, screwy book. Okay. Marcus! Marcus, come look! Well, it's not gonna be Connor and his friends, because we haven't freed them yet. Marcus? Come to talk to you, Marcus. Is that the FBI guy? You have my word. I won't try anything. <laughs> Fuck you. Don't go. No, I'm not going to. Fuck him. That dude's a dick. Don't go, Marcus. I'm not. I'm not armed, Marcus. I don't give a shit. All the cops behind you with snipers and no. Fuck you. Get out of here. to say. Free our people, then we'll talk. I came here to negotiate. Isn't that what you want? Okay, then what are you offering? No, fuck you. See? Okay. Yeah, this dude's a twat, like... Yeah, no, I, I didn't trust that dude as far as like, oh my god. Too close to my... I, 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 no, it doesn't matter, we're fine. The humans are about to launch an attack. Oh yeah, absolutely. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. If we must die today, then we will die free. So, okay. Fire grenades. You know, explosive grenades. So, Your we need to deal with this Connor. Words. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him, or the revolution. Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. And yeah, we got that. We got that. But uh, I think it's actually a fantastic spot to stop the episode. So I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good night.